Largest scandal in Vatican history What was found in Vatican will shock you. Police detectives have busted one of the largest collections of child pornography ever within the walls of the Vatican. Com. As the Catholic Church continued to suppress evidence of institutional child abuse involving high-ranking officials, detectives recently uncovered unprecedented amounts of explicit images and videos of child rape within the Vatican itself. Humansa Free Com reports, the Vatican promoter of justice, Gian Piero Milano, released a report in response to the allegations which he read in full to Catholic Church officials during a judicial ceremony. Due to the Catholic Church's internal investigations protocol, Milano claims he is under no legal obligation to actually name names of people accused of pedophilia and possessing child pornography. However, Federico Lombardi, spokesman for the Holy See, showed a rare display of openness and named Archbishop Joseph Vysilovsky as one of the accused that had triggered the investigation. Although this may seem like a forthcoming gesture by the Vatican, reports of Vysilovsky not only possessing more than 100,000 images and videos of children being forced into sex acts but also of him sexually abusing multiple children in Poland and the Dominican Republic have already previously been exposed in 2014. Due to the Vatican's internal policies, Vasilovsky was investigated but escaped jail for his own protection. In an unusual move by the Church, the high-ranking Catholic official was facing trial from the Vatican's prosecution for his crimes and had been placed under protective house arrest, but mysteriously died before the case even reached a courtroom. The lack of justice following his death left many of his victims frustrated with suggestions that the only reason for the house arrest is the fact that word got out that he was allowed to roam free after he was quietly whisked away from the Dominican Republic and back to the Catholic city-state by Vatican officials in order to avoid prosecution there. According to Church and State, the descriptions of what was actually found on Vysilovsky's computer were more than a little stomach churning. There were more than 160 videos of teenaged boys being forced to masturbate for the camera and perform sex acts on one another.